Korea's secondary stock index, the Kosdaq, fell sharply today on profit taking after an extended rally. Although overall sentiment remains upbeat, today's losses are reinforcing worries that a bubble may be forming on the Kosdaq. Shin Zemin reports. Korea's junior tech heavy Kosdaq market is on a record breaking run. Though the country's small cap focused Kosdaq index closed 2.5% lower on Tuesday, seeming to slow a bit, the overall sentiment not waned. As of market close last Friday, the index logged a monthly gain of 14%, while its bigger cousin, Benchmark Kospi, was trading in the negative territory. The junior boards had even pierced through the 800 mark for the first time in history at its intraday high on Friday and is still eyeing to close above the threshold. And the main driver of the rally is brewing anticipation ahead of fresh government measures to support SMEs set to be unveiled next month. The government's promise to support small and mid-sized firms, as well as its promise to overhaul COSTAC's listing rules, are stimulating the country's junior markets. On top of that, the Financial Services Commission has hinted at potential tax breaks to long-term investors and the COSTAC further amplifying positive sentiments. And apart from the government's push and pull, there's also the boom in pharmaceutical and biotech firms and their upswinging market value. The recent rally can be credited to the government's strong support for the sector, but some are concerned about excessive valuations, especially for biopharmaceutical counters. Though the recent Kosdaq rally is stoking fears of a bubble and profit-taking, there's still plenty of room to grow, even without the popular pharma and biotech sectors. Recovery in the global and local economies is steadily picking up pace, and the upcoming Pyeongchang Winter Olympic Games and worming ties with China could open the doors even further for Kostak listed companies. With the listed firms embracing for the fast approaching fourth industrial revolution, the Kostak index is poised to grow even further, ultimately cementing its position as the world's third largest secondary bourse. Shin Zemin, Arirang News.